Hi everyone, I'm taking the boat again to explore Durgarden and to see Stockholm from the water. I hope you will enjoy today's trip. So yeah, I took a ferry and have arrived to the place called uh, Block Husuden. It's on the same uh, island where uh, they have uh, Skansen Open Air Museum and Djurgården Park. I think the whole island is called Djurgården, not sure, but I think so. So yeah, that's where I'm heading. I'm going to see Djurgården park and enjoy golden autumn. As you see here they have nice trail so you can take a walk and enjoy beautiful views and um, the weather is cold today I would say. Not, not so cold, but uh, on a ferry 
I felt that yeah it is cold so I had to go down yeah but I'm enjoying today's walk and uh, I want to explore uh, Deer Gordon fully uh, um, in my plans uh, uh, I want to visit Vasa Museum Museum of the Sheep So uh, I will tell you a little bit about my plans for today uh, I am planning to enjoy uh, Stockholm's nature nature in uh, Deer Garden then uh, I want to visit uh, Vasa Museum or Museum of the Sheep it's uh, very beautiful I think I will uh, uh, make separate video about uh, this museum and um, also uh, they have a Nordic Museum here on uh, this island I hope that entry in Nordic Museum is for free if yes then I will uh, visit this museum but uh, Vasa Museum of course uh, you have to pay this is a very popular museum to visit uh, in Stockholm uh, so yeah of course uh, this museum uh, is not uh, this museum do not have uh, free entrance you have to pay yeah but uh, now I'm enjoying beautiful views golden autumn and uh, wonderful nature Beloved by locals and visitors, Djurgården is a beautiful place in the middle of Stockholm. This island has been in possession of the crown since the 15th century. Large portions of the island still are under the custody of the crown. King John III was the first to eye this island as a hunting retreat in 1579. Djurgården collects many of the city's most famous museums and cultural attractions, like the Vasa Museum, Grjona Lund, the Abba Museum and of course Skansen. It is also have beautiful and big parks with a lot of family friendly activities. You can reach Durgordon by bus, tram or ferry from the city center. There are also several cafes and restaurants sprinkled all over Durgordon. So currently I am located at this place, Block Husuden, where they have ferry terminal. And I am taking a walk all along till Park Kungliga Durgården, then near Rosendals Garden, and to the place where Skansen is located. I'm at Deer Garden taking a walk and enjoying the nature 
I feel that uh, the rain uh, is starting. I, I hope it will not be hard rain, but I feel some raindrops already. Not good. taking some random trail not sure where this trail will uh, lead me but uh, anyway I'm going hiking enjoying the nature I hope I will manage to finish my hiking and get to Nordic Museum or Vasa Museum before the hot rain starts. I'm not sure if it will be raining, but at least I feel like, yes, where will be rain? Yeah, it's raining, but not so hard. Yeah, it's raining. I need to find a way how to get out from this park, from this forest. Trying to hide from the rain. Here is the labyrinth and it's opened. I think it's more interesting to visit this labyrinth during the summer. And now as you see it's not so interesting.
yeah the rain now is even harder I need to find a place to hide Maybe there. but I hope to find the better place I don't want to waste time and uh, I want to visit the museum Yeah, I think the October, end of October, is not the best time to visit Deer Garden, especially if it's raining. Tram will be in two minutes, so I'm taking the tram till uh, Nordic Museum. Yeah. Let's finish today walking in Jurgården.